so uh with a with a raise of hands or rather uh, let me uh, share my screen and show you uh, how do we access um, a custom kernel through jupiter so let me first of all uh, using jupiter on the system is very easy and very simple uh, all you have to do is visit this particular uh, site it's called uh, jupiter.nurse.gov let me open a new window uh, so that i'm able to log in and And at any point, uh, if you're unable to follow, just uh, stop and uh, ask question so that we can uh, immediately resolve this. So when you log in, it will ask you for a federated identity, click on it, uh, use your nurse credentials, and it should take you to a page like this. I just want everybody uh, to try it. And if you are able to just raise your hands uh, as a, uh, on, on uh, Zoom. So again, the page is jupiter.nurse.gov. Okay, good. So once uh, you are configured for this, uh, the way to log on to Perlmutter through an X system would be Use your uh, SSH, your username, and uh, Perlmutter dot p one dot nurse dot gov. You should you should be able to see a login page like this. Now, many people will not have these uh, directories configured, so you'd have to create these directories, but generally look for a directory called cd.local, uh, rather cd into this directory called .local. If you don't have it, you can create this directory using mkdir.local. Inside this, you will have a directory called share. Within this, go to a directory called Jupyter. Again, if you don't have these directories configured, at each step, you'll have to make this directory. So if you don't have .local, please create a directory called, M called .local in, in your home. Follow it up with another directory called share. And finally, inside share, create a directory called Jupyter. Inside the Jupyter directory, you will have another directory called kernels. Now here you can configure any custom kernel that you wish to launch. And by this, what I mean is let, in, in this particular exercise, we want to use QQuantum. Right, so I will create a directory called QQuantum, which I already have, and let's call it QQuantum. And inside QQuantum, create create a a document file called kernel.json. Create sorry, create a JSON file called kernel.json. Once you create this, you have to copy the following lines. I'm placing what you have to copy in the kernel.json uh, uh, in the Zoom chat. So essentially what, what this allows you to do is use a custom 
kernel on Jupyter with a shifter image. Shifter, ima shifter image is built on a Ku Quantum Docker container provided by NVIDIA and GC. Is everyone clear on this? 